Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are in this beautiful world, wherever you are, wherever you're watching this video, or maybe you're even in the moon. And that's the best intro I have given in the last couple of weeks, because today I invited a very special guest, a very special guest that was already on the channel before, and I want to pick his brain on Bitcoin, but also on a new kick-ass project that is the most hype project, I think, the last couple of weeks, maybe ever in crypto. So let's pop on the beautiful screen here together with, yes, Call the moon. Bam. He's a darling. Cause the devil's on my There he tree. is, Carl. Welcome to Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. And thanks for coming onto the show. Two things today. I really want to know what are, where are we with Bitcoin? Are we still in the bull cycle? Are we in the bear cycle? And the second thing, of course, I saw you were a founder of Casta. Um, I am very curious what you have to tell about that beautiful company over there. So um of Take course. it, Carl. <laughs> Thank you so much for having me back on the channel. It's always a blast. I love your community. Whenever I'm here, I always see so many positive comments. I'm so happy about that. Um, very, very cool. Thank you so much, guys. And guys, leave a thumbs up down below. Let's smash the like button. Um, but yeah, so I think it's very, very obvious to me right now that Bitcoin is still in a bull cycle. Some people are asking me on a daily basis, are we in a bear market? Are we... Like, was 69K, was that the top? But guys, even though it would be a perfect meme to top out at 69K and maybe drop down to $420, <laughs> but no, I think 69K was definitely not the top for this bull cycle. We are going to um, definitely break 100K in this bull cycle. So as long as we're below 100K, we're still bullish, even though that sounds like reversed. But yes. As long as we didn't uh, break 100K, I believe we are in still the bull cycle, which means that we're still going to go up. Um, I think the top of this bull cycle is probably going to be 300 up to $500,000. Um, and that's going to probably happen within like six months or so. So yeah, I'm very, very bullish on crypto. And um, honestly, like every single day that goes by, I get more bullish because I can see not only the technicals are looking great, but all the fundamentals more and more influential big people and institutions are talking more and more positively about uh, Bitcoin. We're seeing countries uh, start being more positive. El Salvador now accepting Bitcoin. Like, come on. The trend is our friend. And right now the trend is clearly towards the moon, I think. Yeah, so it's very beautiful to see on the charts as well. You know, people are still freaking out. Now we all try as influencers to zoom out now and then and to see you know, on the daily and on the weekly, we are still creating higher lows, higher highs. So there is no reason um, um, to, to be freaking out at the moment. Um, I think a lot of people have fear at the moment because, of course, they always watch Plan B and they also would Plan B tweets. And, and now the first time in November, he wasn't right. You know, we weren't arriving at the 98K. Um, but he is also st stating, you know, Plan B is like uh, 100K is still in play. Would you expect the 100k level to be reached in December? Would you expect like 2014, that huge pump that was at that time in November or in 2017, November, December, like in two months we doubled in price? Do you still think that it's possible in December that people will have a very beautiful, happy Christmas? Uh, I don't think that's going to happen. It could happen. It really, really could. But I think 100k is more likely to occur in January or February. That would be the first bull cycle that would be different than the previous two ones again. Uh, yeah, it's like a month later. So it was November 2014, December 2017. So it could be January uh, 2021. 22. So that's what you're saying. Okay, amazing. Yeah. Uh, and then you have a target of 400K extended bull run through 2022. Yeah. You don't think we will see the first 40% crash rebounds and then another 40% crash that we have a total 80%. I think we're going to see corrections. Uh, it's not like we're going to go straight up to like 300 or 500K. We will see corrections. Um, but after the top, we are going to see an 80% correction from the bull market's top. I'm pretty sure about that. Um, is there any currency that you uh, think that people should be uh, looking at at the moment aside of Bitcoin? Yeah, I'm a Bitcoin-minded person. But of, of course, I also invest in some altcoins. So we'd love to have a tip from you. Well, I'm very happy that you invested in Casta. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh, that was the quickie. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Yeah, yeah. I saw the project. And um, to be honest, I was uh, I saw that there was a CEO called Carl. And I was like, okay, 
uh, new project going to target crypto.com and all these cards that they have been using as a traveling family. You know, we already started to use yeah, like the comp competitive cards like Wirex like years ago and Bits in Spain. And, and then I saw it and I'm like, okay, this is again a project. Now I need to step him in. I missed the whole run in, uh, in crypto.com, uh, for example. And, you know, and then I saw you. I saw that you were involved. And for me, that was a, a very clear investment to do. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I mean, I'm super bullish. So I am a co-founder and I'm actually the CMO also of Casta. We are four co-founders. And uh, for everyone who doesn't really know, it's like, you know, we, we want to make crypto easy to use. Right now, it's very hard to send payments for mainstream people and the gas fees are usually very high. So we want to just make sure that people can send like one or two, three dollars uh, of crypto with zero fees and instantly. That's what we're going to do with Casta. So that's, that's like the big selling point. But we're also going to have huge um, DeFi yield strategies where you can make money on your crypto passively. We already have some incredible partners that will be able to give us very, very high yield. Um, I can't give exact numbers now, but it will be higher than the previous or higher than uh, crypto.com. It will be higher than uh, um, BlockFi. It will be higher than all of these other competitors right now. So that's very, very bullish. That is, I mean, I really, really like making passive income. I, I make crypto and then I put my crypto in, uh, in these uh, different yield strategies. And then every single day I'm making profits without even having to touch it. So that's, that's very important for me. So that's why we're focusing a lot on that with Casta. And um, I mean, yeah, like crypto.com, you can see Nexo, you see all these big giants. They are huge. And we believe that we will be better than the competition because we have a clear focus also on payments. No one else is doing that. Uh, not, not in the way that we're going to do it. I mean, instant and free transactions is very important for us. And right now we can't see that in crypto. And actually very, very few countries have it at all. So we want to um, take that concept, which is something that we have in Sweden, something called Swish. Uh, it, Swish reached critical mass adoption in, in Sweden. It's instant and free transactions with fiat, but we want to take this into crypto and globally. And um, that's Casta basically. And our wait list has been absolutely exploding. I don't know if you were keeping up on, on Twitter, but it was insane. We've reached 150,000 email signups a couple of days ago. And that's like yeah. one month after we put up the website and we didn't spend even $1 yeah. in marketing yet. Yeah, I, I saw I think, it go completely viral. I'm, I'm, I, I, did, I don't think I have ever seen a project go like viral like this on Twitter. And even yeah, it has never happened socials. before. No, I, it never happened before. I never saw it before. And we, I checked this morning, we just broke 90,000 followers on our Twitter, which is also something I never saw before, especially for a project that didn't even launch yet. We still yeah. didn't launch the app and the token is also still not launched yet, but we reached 90,000 followers on Twitter. Honestly, it's mind blowing and I never saw it before. I don't think we will ever see that again, to be honest. Um, and I think this is because of the fact that obviously, um, the product will be amazing. We have an incredible team and people can see that. And um, people also believe in the vision, like instant and free transactions and making money on your passive income. Uh, I think it's very, very important that people understand that this is their chance to, uh, to be able to use something like crypto.com before everyone else. Yeah. So we are going to basically um, challenge the giants. And uh, that's why people seem bullish. And everyone who's in the waitlist will get some very, very cool things in the future. Maybe we can even leave the link down below, casta.io, uh, for everyone who wants to be in the waitlist um, and join the Twitter, of course. Yeah. I think I think you said something very important over there in that, start, that piece. It's like um, you make your profits in crypto and you put them in products like Casta. Um, to live of the yields or the staking that you make over there. And that's exactly what I am trying to teach my children. Of course, my children are lucky because they will grow up with a few Bitcoins in their personal accounts. So I took them out of the schools 
to uh, learn them how to manage their capital. Because in my opinion, Bitcoin will be going way, way higher than the 500K in the next bull run. So my kids will automatically become millionaires. And the only thing they need to understand is how to manage their capital and live of the yields of the capital. And that is something I really um, see in all these projects that that will make it possible, you know, that you don't need to work anymore for your money, but your money starts to work for you. And um, so my last question to you about Costa is because uh, the technical details, man, I would love to do an interview with one of the, uh, the, the CEOs or the technical guys as well to, to just get deeper into it. But there is only one question. Is there any possibility that Casta is going to make something to target the youth, like from 12 years old? Because I think there is a saying that is worldwide, the youth has the future. So if you target the youth, they will be your customer forever. Just like the banks give the, you know, all the kids like a, a, a piggy bank account where, with a free 25 euros or something like that. Is there something in Casta that is um, that is thinking about um, maybe including use because that is your future? I think it, our first strategy will be to focus on the average crypto user, which is the older generation, somewhere between 20 to 40 years old, um, because that's our like you know initial target audience that will immediately be interested in this product. Because if you look at Crypto YouTube, crypto Twitter, uh, the user base of uh, Bybit, crypto.com. It's, it's one specific yeah. audience using these platforms. So we're going to target this platform to begin with because we know that these people will love the platform. But obviously, we are one of the projects that definitely will look way beyond crypto because we are not only like a crypto product, we are a mainstream product. We're going to challenge Revolut. We're going to challenge PayPal. So we are definitely breaking in to the, uh, the bigger mainstream. And I can't tell you who it is, but we actually have signed on a huge mainstream YouTuber with tens of millions of followers and actually another YouTuber with like, I think, yeah, 20 million followers that are mainstream YouTubers. They are also on board investing and will support Casta, which is amazing. So we're going to tap into the, the bigger market out there of people that simply are looking for instant and, uh, and um, uh, free transactions and also to make money. Because right now it's hard to, to get nice passive income out there. Uh, I mean, you can buy stocks, but you, it's very hard to get a high yield. We are going to give users an incredibly attractive yield um never like it's very very hard to find that in the mainstream Ob obviously in crypto you can find many different cool yield strategies but what we will do is we will do all of the yield farming on the back end so the user doesn't have to so we're going to so you give us your bitcoin and then we take your crypto and we do a bunch of very very high level uh, yield farming and different DeFi strategies uh, on the back end, and then we give the user the profits. And um, that, that's what we want to really, really focus on, make sure that our users make money while using the platform. And that's why I think the hype is growing so much right now, because everyone wants to be one of the first people to use the app. And obviously, to be the first one to use the app, you have to be in the wait list. Um, but, uh, but yeah, join the wait list and, and then you will be one of the first ones to try this out. And, um, we will definitely reward everyone who is, um, among the first people in our wait list. Very, very cool. Amazing. Is there, is there, um, is there a date that they like, that the launch will be there or that the people of the wait list will be contacted? Do you already have a date or like? Uh, we haven't announced a date yet, but the app will be launched in Q1 next year. And the uh, token launch will also probably happen Q1 next year. Not Amazing. later. Could, could happen in December, but most likely January, I would say. Okay, that's amazing news. That's amazing news. So uh, that's still during the bull run, like during your opinion and my opinion of the bull run, uh, which is really beautiful. Um, I want to keep it short because uh, I know that my viewers love these short 10-minute videos. Carl. Um, I respect you very much what you have done for the industry. I really like what you're doing now with Casta because I think that would be a product that I as a family um, really are going to use also for the yield, but also really I saw that there is going to be a debit card and everything uh, tied to it in the future, which of course is perfectly if you can't spend Bitcoins directly. Um, I want to thank you so much for coming to the channel, uh, for giving your opinion again on Bitcoin, 
please remember, guys, he told you here as well, the bull run is not over. Still buy Bitcoins every day. Even if you buy at 60K, you can still double it during this bull run. So it's like very easy dollar cost average in and dollar cost average out if you don't want to go all in. Um, but it's not over, in my opinion, as well. Thank you for the introduction about Casta. Um, I, I really like the project. I really like how it's being hyped, how people understand um, that it will be uh, one of those projects that is like, targeting the simple use because that is what we miss at the moment people are still figuring out how to install a crypto wallet how to do that how to buy bitcoins if that is combined and simplifies the use of bitcoins the adoption will be going way faster uh, yeah, thank you for the explanation is there anything else that you want to end um, the video with um i'm just very very bullish on crypto in general i'm very happy to uh, to see casta going live because i think the reason why we started casta is because we want to make the crypto mainstream adoption happen faster. We are so impatient. We just want to make it happen now, now, now. That's why we, we're gonna make like we're gonna make crypto and Bitcoin easy, simple for the average person, for your granny, for your you know the, all the old people, the young people. Everyone will have a very very easy time learning how to use this, and um, that's why I'm so happy about you know crypto and casting in general. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm coming from Mexico, Carl coming from Dubai. A few years ago, we, I was in the boring Holland. He was probably in the cold Sweden. Um, uh, beautiful to see you again on screen. I hope to meet you again very soon somewhere in a, in a beautiful beach in Mexico or in Dubai. I loved it there as well. Um, again, thank you for all the viewers. I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this information, the bull run information, the cast information, give this video a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment. What is your opinion about Casta, about these kinds of projects? What is your opinion about the bull run? And I really need some more subscribers. So subscribe, 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 subscribe. Thank you guys and see you next time again. Bam.